for the past few months, I've been vocal about things I was never vocal about before. Politics, um, global health, things that I did not know about. I consider myself a one-trick real estate pony. I know a little bit about music too, but I would never go and dip my toes into the waters of controversy because I was afraid what people would think and say about me behind the scenes. And I'm in sales and I thought it would affect my business. But after months and months, I've keep my mouth shut. I've realized that I want to use social media for what it's intended to do in the first place, and that's to communicate and to let your voice be heard as long as you're being respectful. So here's what I have to say. For all you people that continue to think that COVID-19 is a hoax, for all you people that think that this is a big scam, and for all you people that continue to live your life like you did before March 2020, you ready for it? Quit being stupid. I am so tired of seeing pictures and videos online of people living their life like nothing is wrong. And, I, and as of last week, the big quote that we got from our quote unquote leader was that the problem with more tests is you have more results. Hey, guess what? That's the reason that you have a test is to get results, okay? So all you people that continue to go and live in this selfish, idiotic bubble full of entitlement, ignorance, and really just a big matter of disrespect for all the people that actually are taking this thing seriously, stop, stop. Stop going and putting people at risk that you don't even know, all right? It's not about you anymore. It's not about you. It's about the people that are high risk. It's about the people that never thought they had a risk, like children. It's about my grandmother. It's about my fiance who has asthma. It's about me that has asthma. It's about people that have to go and rely on you to quit being a selfish, fool to get back to the life that we miss. Stop. Please go and be a leader. And if you don't want to be a leader, follow somebody that's talking with sense. Follow somebody that wants to go and do what's right. Don't just follow somebody because they want to make as much money as possible. Follow someone who cares about your health, your well-being, and getting this thing back to where it was before this thing took over our world. So, I'm sure this is going to go and have some of you guys unfollow me, maybe lose some respect, maybe you don't want to work with my companies. That's okay. As long as you listen to this and as long as it hopefully resonates a little bit and it hits home, please take action. You cannot go and fight the data that we continue to see. It is in the dead of summer, almost July, and numbers are doing this. In the hottest states, Arizona, Texas, and Florida, yet people continue to post pictures online at the clubs, at the bars, at the beaches. And that to me is being disrespectful to me. And I'm tired of it. So please go and do something. Please show respect for your fellow human, whether you live in America or whether you live in Europe or whether you want to live on the moon. You're not going to get to the moon anytime soon if we can't get on a plane or on a rocket ship. And you people that continue to go and be disrespectful, I hope you do find your way to a rocket ship because it's really freaking annoying. So people take this thing seriously. Cases are on the rise. People are dying. I have lost friends to COVID-19. They did not die with COVID-19. They died of it. So wake up world. Please be respectful. Please love each other. And please take this thing seriously. And if you don't want to take it seriously, then keep your business and keep your decisions to yourself. Because no matter how hard you don't want to be, you influence people. And influenced idiots go and influence other idiots. And that means we're going to be home that much longer. And normal life is going to be that much longer delayed. So I hope this changed at least one person's perspective. I hope that God continues to bless you. And I hope that you all can please stay home and stay safe. Because COVID-19 is still here. And no matter how hard you try, the only way to fix it is to be unselfish, to be at home, to wear a mask in public, and to please look out for your fellow human. God bless you guys.